Today, Pamela Turner, a native of Fayette, Mississippi, who was gunned down by police outside her apartment in Texas, was laid to rest in her hometown. But the family is demanding answers. WJTV 12's Alex Love attended the funeral and has more on this exclusive story you'll only see here on WJTV 12. Jade, it all centers around mental health because, according to neighbors, according to neighbors and the fam and the family, Turner has been suffering from a mental illness for years now. And to them, the police did not need to use deadly force. Um, At 44 years old, Pamela Turner was a mother of two and about to become a grandmother when her kids heard the tragic news. I had literally five hours before just got out of the hospital from having my baby. Um, my brother called me. I just got out the shower and was about to lay down. He said, I, I think they're killing mama. It began May 13th outside Turner's apartment complex when an officer on patrol stopped her and learned she had two warrants, but an altercation began and Baytown police reported Turner took the officer's taser and tased him. Then while she laid on the ground, the officer returned fire. It was uh, mishandled. Uh, like you say, police need to be proper trained. Uh, just, just, just wasn't done right. Uh, I just, just couldn't see it. And I'm just hoping that we get justice for Ms. Pamela Turner. The Turner family says for years, Pamela suffered from schizophrenia, forcing her to behave different and going forward, want officers to be more aware of handling those diagnosed with mental illness. You never know what a person is going through. You never know what a person's strategy is. You never know what a person's mind is going through versus a way of how things should be handled. Somehow they need to train these policemen better to deal with mentally ill people because it could have been another way they could have handled it or he could have called for backup. From here, the Turner family plans to head back to Texas where they'll continue spreading their main message. Justice for Pamela. Justice for Pamela. Justice for Pamela. Justice. The officer involved in the shooting has been placed on administrative leave while the Baytown Police Department conducts their own investigation. We're also told body cam footage was taken during the altercation but has not yet been released.